Good evening everyone and welcome back to another Farming Simulator 22 live stream. Little bonus stream as it is release day for Farm Sim so I thought I'd put this one on slightly later. So we have had our first look already um, but in today's one I think we're going to take a look, a more in-depth look at Erlengrat. Uh, obviously Erlengrat, obviously you'll love and know it, obviously was on Farm Sim 19 but has been sort of upgraded for Farm Sim 22. Um, with you know the production change and production line, so that's what we're going to be taking a look at today, and then we might get back onto the French run. We're just going to do a bit of anything, really. Um, anyway, let's see. What we have got in the chat. Uh, it might be a little bit quieter. As it's sort of late. Uh, we've got Munchies, we've got Mr. Nobody, and we've got Idona. You have FS19, but is 22 really worth the hype? If anything, I think 22 looks worse. It's not a massive upgrade to FS19, but there is a few new features and a few new bits. But yeah, it's not the biggest of upgrades. Um, but yeah, hopefully everyone's all well. Nice little thing about the menu, you can see it changing seasons, which I think is quite a cool little thing it does there. Hello Davidoff, how are you? So let's go into Korea, we're just going to do single player again. Um, we'll go empty slot, um, we'll do farm manager, yeah I think we'll do farm manager, shall we do farm manager, or new farmer, mm. I don't know what we should we go for, I think we'll go for, hmm, I'm not too sure, new farmer or farm manager, because I'm farm manager you get money to buy stuff yourself, then new farm. we'll go for new farmer for now. Uh, and we'll start with Erlengrat, which is what we have seen before and have played before. Probably have to customise our character again, uh, which is a little bit annoying. A little bit annoying the way you can't sort of just do it. You know, keep the same one for each. You know, each farm you go into, it seems you have to create a new one every time. Um, so we'll quickly go through this. Um, I guess if you haven't seen it, well, this is the customisation, much more in depth uh, in this one as it is. Well, just better than FS19 this. Do you think this game is worth it? I'm not sure whether or not to get it. Same with some other people. It's alright. It's a bit of an upgrade to FS19. But there's not a big, big upgrade. But it's decent. I mean, it's a new farm sim. So, let's well give it a bash. Um... Yeah, we'll go, for, we'll go for that. Hello, gamer boy. How are you? Um, let's go for... Like the person doing the forestry, or we could look at the red dead person. Uh, let's go for just, just this guy. Uh, we'll pop that on, set that to sort of grey. That's always the colour I wear. Um, we'll change these. We'll put them to black. Always what I wear. Shoes. Let's go for the usual. Good to go, my boy. I'm good. Hat. Oh, we don't wear a hat. Gloves. Skip them. Don't wear glasses. There we go. Uh, no, we don't need to do any of that. But this is Erlengrat. Obviously, we played this quite a bit. Obviously, had um, Pete, Glenn, Pivers doing all the farm on here. Um, but yeah, hey, can we try and get up to 10 likes? That would be lovely. Obviously, it might be fairly quiet as it is slightly late and it is farm sim, so it's not going to be busy. I've already seen they have updated this. Cause this was like a big shed before here. And that's just a little. Well, it is supposed to be like, I don't know. This looks a little bit different. Much more detail on the cows as well, on the livestock. I mean, sitting down, properly moving about. Cool. Uh, in fact, we don't do we, we don't really need cows at the moment. Shall we sell the cows? We don't really have anything for them at the moment. Um, so, yeah, let's, let's get rid of the cows. We don't really need them at the moment. Uh, how do we sell... Uh, farm. Will you do multiplayer on this like you did on FS19? Yes, we will do at some point. That's good, Mr. Nobi. Hey, Gildy. Long time OC. I'm all good. How are you, mate? Yeah, let's sell off the farms. I know we did this before on FS19. Um, as well, there's no need for them at the moment. Um, so let's get rid of them. Let's sell them. Evening, Gordon. Uh, and, and you. You can go as well. Yes, all of them sell. Of course, cool. so we haven't got any cows now, so poor cows, they're gone. Uh, let's have a look at the map, see if that looks any different. I think it is pretty much exactly, well, it is pretty much yeah, exactly the same as what it was before. 
Uh, but you obviously now you get the supply change, uh, supply supply chains. Um, so there's a little bit more to do uh, than what there was before. All these extra bits on here. Anyway, uh, let's um, right. Let's see. So what field do we already own? Do we not own, own any fields? Oh, no, I think that's the thing about this. You start off with um, cutting the grass. Um, yeah, you can see we own around here. Well, we've got 117k, so we haven't got a lot. So, is there a little field we can buy? Hmm, that's not really... Hmm. Nothing really. I think we'll have to start off grass then, for now. Let's get in the trailer. Uh, oh, the little one there. That's quite cool. Um, where's the mower? Is that the mower? I think that's the mower. Uh, a bit more work wise than that's winter, so I'll be back on more. Fair enough, um, Gildy. That's, that's not the mower there, is it? That's tiny. Well, let's pick it up, let's do it. Must be a better mower than that around, mustn't there? Ah, look at this. You actually get the little mini mower. Look at that. That's quite cool. We're not going to use that, though. Uh, I suppose we'll use this, I guess. Yeah, we don't really own much. What should we buy a field? That's probably the best thing to do. Um, evening loot, how you doing? Obviously, you've got seasons built into this one. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, you can still borrow money, so we might have to do that. Is there any new vehicles and equipment in this game? Tons more, I don't know. Yeah, tons. Tons of new vehicles and brands. Um, how you doing, Davidoff? Hello Basil, I'm on Xbox Series S and the XP FPS seems really low. That's what Basil. No, not too sure, mate. Right, let's turn that off for now. We don't need any of that. Uh, pause it? I suppose pause it or no? We'll do that. Um, turn that off. Turn all of these off. Uh, turn that off as well. Um, off, off. There you go, just sorting the settings out there. Right, I don't think we're going to go around in this thing. This is going to take forever to uh, cut the grass. And I, we only really want to take a little look tonight. As this won't be our main farm. So what we'll do, actually, is we'll go for a look around the map. Let's do that. We won't do any actual farming on here. Let's see what changes have been made. And the little electric tractor. It feels weird not coming down here and seeing the massive farm we've got built on the fields there, it's weird. Evening laser jet, you might need a field. Yeah, graphically it does look a little bit better, but there's not a massive upgrade. Right, let's come along here. And this is the next gen version, so I'm not sure what it would be like on the last gen. It might be very similar, very similar to FS19. Yeah, this is um, this is next gen. So it looks a little bit better. Racing around the fields. You're gonna get it for Christmas, and I love farming. Awesome. But yeah, we'll go for a little drive round, um, and just see the changes. That tractor moves. Yeah, nice little electric one. Hello, Tony. Even oh yeah, hopefully you're well. Um, that's the barn or the animal dealer up there, I believe. And you come down here, you've got the petrol station. But yeah, well, I think we'll go for a little drive around. We'll have a little explore. Uh, and then we'll go back onto our French map and do farming uh, on there. I just wanted to sort of see, you know, what's been changed to this. Oh, so yeah, this was part of the Alpine, Alpine Farming DLC on FS19. So you may have already played this map, like myself. Right, let's uh, let's get around it. Can you still drive the trains? Yeah, you can still drive the trains. I haven't tried that yet. I would imagine that's probably exactly the same system to um, to do that. Cool. Man, it does look good. Render distance is much higher as well as before. Sort of the mountains in the distance, you know, sort of looked a bit rubbish. 
Um, but it looks decent. We'll drive into the town. Um, it's a fairly small map. Most of it's sort of up in the mountains, and that's just more for sort of cutting grass. But most of the fields are just all, oh god, this way, all together. Oh, same the DLC uh, from 19 don't transfer to 22. Well, they'll just bring out new DLC, Mr. Nobody. Yeah, let's bring out new DLC. Last gen's okay, fair enough. Support your local farmers. Around we go. There's the train going across the top there, which it looks like the loco is at the wrong end. If you own this map already, do you have to buy it again for FS22? Uh, it's part of the base game, I don't know. Yeah, it's part of the base game. Right, heading into the town. You've got the massive hotel up there as well. But yeah, we'll do a, a little drive round and then we'll get onto the French map and continue from where we left off yesterday. Yeah, it does look better though. Oh, the chocolatier actually. Where's the cho oh, Here's the chocolatier here. Or is this the cheese? Uh, this is the. That's cheese, yeah. There's the cheese place there. Because you can actually look through the windows. Or maybe you can actually go inside now. Yeah, you can see them making all the stuff in there, which is quite cool. But yeah, I wonder if you can go inside now. Because this part of the production. Uh, yeah, you can see that by production point. 50,000 to make it. Well, that's not too bad, is it? You can buy the cheese. But yeah, that's not bad. Um, that's the cheese point. And you've got the chocolatier as well. I don't think that one's as detailed as the um, cheese place. Let's head up to the hotel. And we sort of get an overlook of the uh, of the map. Let's, let's go up there. Let's go across here. I'm just using the controller tonight. Um, I will use the word at some point, but I just can't really bother to set it up all tonight. Uh, once we properly get farming, then I'll plug it in. Um, you've got to have a hairnet if you go inside. Probably I don't know, yeah. We'll head up to the hotel, yeah, that gives us a good overlook of the map. Um, so that's good. Let's head up here. But yeah, who's got the game themselves? Who's been on this today? Oh, sorry, we're holding up the other car there. A mini little tractor, though. Quite a cool little tractor, though, and it's electric. So good for the environment. Especially as we're in Switzerland. But yeah, this is the uh, viewpoint up here. If we quickly just uh, break the law and drive onto there. Got a little bit along here. Evening, Richard. I've been on this map and game. Awesome. Game I've always got it as well. It feels like one of those places on GTA where you'd find like a parachute and you can just jump off. Well, obviously, it, you, you can't. But you can jump off, uh, but you don't get a parachute. Like that, which I didn't actually mean to do there. Let's quickly get back into the tractor. But yeah, that's an overview of the uh, of the map there. It does go up, uh, go up into the mountains as well. Um, yeah, it's a nice map. Uh, probably we'll come back to this at some point. Uh, do a little bit more on it. But yeah, in terms of visuals, there's not a big, big difference. Uh, I mean, there's there's a slight difference, but there's not a big difference in visuals. I suppose sort of if you're on the next gen version, you might have sort of PC graphics, but. Um, yeah, in terms of the way it looks compared to FS19, there's not a big difference. Um, you still get the sort of way you can see. I mean, look at the railway, for example, there. You it, so you can't see it. You can just see the ballast underneath. Um, so, yeah, it's still not everything renders in quite correctly. But anyway, let's get on to the French map. Um, let's not save that. Uh, and let's continue from where we left off. And we go. Hey, there's Amanda. How you doing? You're 50-50 on it. Fair enough. Well, I thought, thought we'd get it, and then we can, you know, do the usual farm some streams every now and again. And obviously get you guys involved as well. So it probably will be the same as what it was for FS19, where we do it, you know, once or twice a week. 
mostly once a week um, at the best of times. Right, let's get into the harvester. It seems to be lit up there. Hello, Brian. Why are you saying sorry, mate? You've got it, but I don't really know what to do. Fair enough, Luke. Uh, and let's uh, continue with uh, with the field. Cool. Let's uh, let's lower that down. Uh, and let's quickly get that bit there. I'll probably get it because I might as well. Fair enough. Sounds much better though. Sort of here, churning all, churning all of it in. Looks nice, fair enough. Even in Russian Doke, how are you? Yeah, just doing uh, single player at the moment. Uh, probably um, maybe at the weekend or next week. Uh, we're go we're going to do a multiplayer. Just get the farm sort of set up first. Get you know all the jobs we need to do and that sort of stuff. Otherwise, everyone comes in and no one has a job to do. So, no point in that. Little harvest to start off with. A cool little harvest to this one. Let's quickly uh, get that. But yeah, if you would like to see more of this map, uh, do check out the first look live stream we did actually do last night. Um, and we yeah, pretty much drove around the whole map. Would you do multiplayer members only? Can I join? Uh, not today, laser jet mate. No, the uh, members multiplayer will probably be for ETS too. For when Heart of Russia comes out. I'm a tractor man on a farm in real life as well. Oh, I see, Gildy. Awesome, mate. What do you work on? Like work on a farm or do you sort of own the farm and work on it I guess as well. Good to hear Russian Dog real quick. Should it take a while to make money on ETS? It does take a while. Uh, you want to go for sort of the longer journeys. So rank up your long distance and high value um, stats or perks. Yeah you can join those when we do do multiplayer. And take out a loan as well, Russian Doke, uh, for you know getting other trucks, and you can just pay it back. Uh, we're not doing multiplayer at the moment, Luke. But when we do do multiplayer, it will just be first come first serve. So whoever gets in first is is in. Cool. Yeah, I'm probably certain this is a new brand to the game. The Witch Far. Some sort of German brand, I guess that is them. Top liner. Little green tractors. Cool. Let's bring that back. Just going around in loops for this one. It's only a little field. So I'm not really going to bother doing rows. Yeah, hello Metro, how are you? Oh, Russia, that's all good. And come and try and get up to 25 likes. That would be uh, that'd be awesome. Round we go. Cool. And yeah, tomorrow morning I'll be in sort of a little bonus stream as well, but that will be on flight simulator uh, tomorrow, as requested by Gamer Boy. That will be tomorrow morning, so it'll be a fairly quiet one. Um, but may as well stick it in them. Um, I think you said something about this yesterday, but I can't remember. Is this cr yeah, it is cross platform? I don't know. Yes. Um, yeah, you, you have to join via the server browser if you're on Xbox or PC. Obviously, to join me. Yeah, it's cross platform, Mr. Nobody, which is a good thing. Obviously, it's good that sort of, you know, each platform doesn't exclude itself from the other. Obviously, most games are becoming cross-platform now, aren't they? That's a good thing. My uncle has his own farm just over 1,000 acres. I work on a good friend's farm. I've been working there for 20-plus years now. Fair enough, Gildy. How many games do you play a day? I cannot keep up. I mean, when I'm off-stream, not you know, when I'm not showing off gameplay, I'm usually just on sort of one game. So, at the moment... 
I probably when I have finished this stream, I'll just go and play a bit of Battlefield for a bit. So it's only really when I'm streaming I'll play all these different games. But when yeah, off stream, I'll probably just stick to one game. Uh, yeah, we do play quite a bit on the channel. Cool, almost done with this field. Uh, and then we'll go and get the trailer, which I think is still at the grain mill. And it's a slow process, but we'll build up the farm slowly. You play on Xbox, so I can finally join. Awesome. And also a tactic I've learned from... Uh, the farming masterminds, Pete, Glenn and all that. Field flipping, we'll have to do that at some point as well. Where you buy a field which is ready to be harvested, harvest it and then just sell it after and then you get all of the produce off of it so you're making a profit. Quite a bit, quite a bit of a profit. And then buy another field and do the same. So uh, do that at some point. Yeah, what's the last gen version like? Also, I've heard quite a bit about the next gen version on on this, but what's the last gen version like? Is there a big difference, or what's it like? You're not getting FS22 fair enough, Richard. I thought I'd pick it up. Um, obviously, it's a game we do do on the channel. See, not too regular, uh, but some you know where we can get you guys involved as well. See, not at the moment as it's we're doing single player, but it's a game where we can get the channel involved in. So I thought I'd pick it up. And that's what I always used to uh, grow. I can't be off to see to grow. Fair enough. Last gen is decent. Fair enough. Fair enough as well, Mr. Quicko. So it seems like it's fairly mixed then, in terms of people who are getting FS22 and then people who aren't getting FS22. It doesn't seem to be either, or oh, I'm not getting it, like tons of that, or, you know, I'm all getting it. it. Seems to be a bit of a mix. So I suppose mixed opinions on it. Fair enough. I suppose wait for more DLC for the game, more modded maps and all that, and then get it. Have you ever played Hunter Call of the Wild? No, I've seen it, uh, but not all we got a trophy or sat for. Reap what you sow. There we go, first trophy of FS22. No, I've seen Hunter Call of the Wild, but um, not played it. I wouldn't really say it's my cup of tea. Okay, let's move that forward. But yeah, if you are enjoying the stream, do uh, feel free to leave a like and do subscribe if you want to do, uh, do. If you do want to see more, uh, we do do daily streams. If you're not on farm sim every day, farm sim is usually once a week, sometimes twice a week. Um, so it's not too much. Uh, but we do do it. Yeah, if you want to see more, feel free to sub. Hello, gaming room. How are you? Yeah, tomorrow we'll be on flight sim. The update is slowly getting there. I think I've got about 50 gigabytes left now of it. So it's getting there. But that will be tomorrow morning. And then tomorrow evening we'll do TSW. And I'm thinking maybe... Or if not Wednesday, we'll do some ETS2 trucking again. So I've been loving that recently. Good to gaming room. I'm good. There we go. There is our first field. Almost harvested. Now I think we've got... Uh, okay, that one's got nothing on it. Not. I think that one's ready to be... Cultivated. Um so yeah. We'll sell off what we've got from here. Yeah, good to see you, gamer. I'm good. Hello Sabre, how are you? Good evening. 
Uh, right, let's uh, turn off that. Uh, no, pick that up. We'll go and get the trailer. But yeah, this is the French map. Hot, hot Belleron. Probably not the way you say it, but... Can you open... Oh, hello. No, I don't want a guided tour. So far, so good, usually. However, you have a lot to do. So it does make sense to hire helpers on your... You could have said that a little bit earlier to hire. Uh, whenever a job can be executed by a helper, it will uh, be indicated in the top left panel. Hire a helper to take care of the rest of the field. Well, I think it's a little bit late now. We've already done the field. Um, okay, maybe that's just telling me for next time. Uh, well, let's um, let's go and get the trailer, which I think is over at the grain mill at the moment. There it is. Uh, let's get that on, and let's get going. And you also get the new AI system as well. So let's see how that, this works then. So, see, create job. Go to... Uh, can we set it to go to the harvester? Go to target position. There. No, there. There. Go. Go there. Select. Yeah, that's where I want it to go. So, can we? Will it go now? I don't know. Um. Pick. Select. Well, I've picked where we want it to go. But yeah, this is the new AI system. So the AI before could, well, just only complete a job in a field. Now you can do deliveries and all that sort of stuff. So there's much more you can do now of workers, um, which is all right. Uh, I'm not sure how we select it. Target position. There. Have we done it? Start job. There we go. We've done it. We're uh, starting the job. Oh, hello. Look, they're driving. Look, that's not me driving. That's the AI doing it. So if we leave them, they're off on the way. Using all of our money. Cool. See, so yeah, the AI can do a little bit more now. In fact, I'll open it back up, and you can um, you can see exactly what they can do. So, let's have a look. Uh, select. Can we do another job? Uh, create job. So you've got go to. So I suppose just transport stuff. Um, no, not that. And then there was. D d d uh, deliver stuff as well. I can't seem to get back onto there now. Okay, I'll just cancel the job. That's all good. Uh, deliver, load and deliver. See, so, yeah, there's a little bit more you can do now with the AI. Right, where's the. Did we cancel it? I think we cancelled it. Well, that gives you a little look at the AI system. You love the new AI? Awesome. Uh, good to hear Sabre. Tired, but good. What I need is someone who can show me how to play it. Uh, there's various farms some YouTubers out there, uh, Luke. I wouldn't say we're a, a big farm some YouTuber. <laughs> Obviously, we don't do it a lot. Um, but there are other big YouTubers out there who do farm sim as well. And there is tutorials in the game as well, which can help you. Yeah, I just got the normal edition, Mr. Quicko, 45 quid. Yeah, let's go and uh, fill the trailer up with all of the wheat. Around we go. But yeah, just using the controller tonight. Uh, but when we actually get proper farming, you know, multiplayer, I'll plug in the wheel then. You are the TSW YouTuber. Quite literally, I don't know. Yeah. Hmm, I don't know why I've still got it on the map, though. I've still got the little marker of the AI on the map. How do we get rid of that? There. No. I don't want that on the map. Can we cancel that? No, it's just going to stay in the middle of the river for now. That will do. Right, let's go around here. I think this is the way to the farm. Yeah, Dagway and he does it all the time. That's where other games too. Yes, exactly that, Mr. Quicko. Good description there. This is the map I'm using. Do you think it's the best map out of the three? Um, personally, I'd say... Well, I haven't done much of this so far, but I'd say it probably is the best out of the three. 
Uh, the American map, I'm not too interested in, um, as I'm just not really interested in the American maps from Farm Sim. Um, Erdengrat, that's a very good one, obviously from FS19, but obviously we've seen it before. Um, so yeah, personally I'd say this is the best one. Although I think on this one you don't get collectibles, on Elm Creek you do. Um, that we did last night and we found, went in the cave and found all of the little toys you could pick up. Or little models. Let's empty that into there. How do I get a worker to deliver my products for me? Um, pretty much do what we just did. Go onto the AI menu uh, on here. Create a job. It should say deliver, load and deliver. Um, and obviously just well, say where you want them to go. And then off they go. Seems to be fairly straightforward to use the AI system. Right, that's that. Let's go and park the harvester up. Looks like we've also got a trailer for the header as well. Although, as we're not going anywhere at the moment, I think we'll just park it up like this. Evening, Glenn. How's your farm getting on, mate? I bet Glenn's already got like a million or something in the bank. Let's see about that for now. Does feel much smoother as well, as opposed to um, 19. Right, let's go and sort this out. What are the three maps? Elm Creek, Erlengrat, and Hop to Bellerin, which we're doing at the moment. So, French one, Swiss one. Uh, well, I, think, I believe Erlengrat's a Swiss one. Austrian one, but it's a yeah, Swiss one. Um, and then the American one, which is Elm Creek. Any idea on how the production chains work? Well, it did give us an option to buy the cheese people in Erlengrat, so I'm guessing you can buy it and then sell stuff from there. I suppose, you know, take the. What do you do for cheese? Milk. Yeah, cheese is milk, isn't it? Milk. Well, yeah, milk. Milk's included in it. So I suppose you transport the milk to the cheese place. They then do the magic and make it into cheese. Um, and then you'd then collect it and I suppose sell it. I don't know where you would sell it to, I guess to the shop or maybe you could do it to customers somewhere. But that's sort of, that's, I think that's sort of the gist of it. Fair enough, Glenn. Oh, I found a few issues. Oh, Glenn. <laughs> you might have to uninstall it. Let's get that on, we've got the um, cover on. Cool. Yeah, look at this coming down here, gorgeous. Pet air balloon up there, you've got the railway viaduct there, the village over there. It's lovely. And then you've got the little car, I think there's a car sort on here. Yeah, up there, or the place. Yeah, see, I don't know. Thanks for uh, coming in, mate. Yeah, sounds good. But yeah, I'll probably start with uh, Flight Simulator tomorrow, which will be about half nine. I'm not going to confirm it, confirm it. Um, although, it, it probably will be. 90% chance I will be doing it. Right, let's, um, let's unload this. If we can, um, should be alright. Well, that's uh, going into there. Yeah, there we go, and there goes the money going up. Lovely. And we'll take this one back to the farm and see what we can do next. There you go, 8,000 for that, so not too much, but it's obviously only a little trailer. I've just on Steam, it's so much cheaper. Awesome, Gordon. I'm guessing it's done a bit, but is it, what, how much cheaper is it on PC then? Has it done a bus sim where it's like 45 on console and 30 on PC? I suppose, yeah, if you have got an Xbox and, yeah, through GeForce, I suppose, yeah, you could just 
get it on PC and um, play it through there. Nothing's working for me. Um, have you got the right equipment to do it, ladies and gentlemen? And have you got enough to go in the trailer? The map seems to be working okay. Cool. Out we go. Yeah, can we try and get up to 30 likes? Not too sure. That's a good point. This is a French map. And it says stop. Um, unless... It is the same in French. Um, stop being stop, um, but I wouldn't think so. Just a little detail, just a little nag. Obviously, it's nothing really anything, but still. Uh, you should get OMC too. I can show you how to get UK buses and maps, uh, not as DLC. Uh, maybe at some point in the future, Ryan, but OMC is quite an old game. Uh, and we already have bus sim and the bus, which I guess the bus is sort of the new OMSI. Um, so for now, we're, we're, I'm all good, Ryan. Oh, I was at 35, that's not too bad. Even Nathan, how are you? You should be able to uh, make them laser jet. I love these old attractors, much better than the new ones with all their screens all over the place sound much better as well look at that I think it's one of the new brands as well whoa out of nowhere I suppose maybe this is a French brand you know French brand starting on a French map uh, there was no notification yeah yeah, I'm good, Nathan. Right, so we've harvested the field. Uh, we've also got another tractor over here, so let's see what's on the back of that. I think there's a cultivator on the back, or is it a plough? Uh, that is a cultivator, I believe. Let's uh, let's turn that on, and we'll get to work with this field. Uh, attach. Yeah, it's a cultivator. Oh, I see pivots. Got yeah. Right, let's uh, lower that down. Let's go. Let's start cultivating this. This is another sort of older track. So it looks slightly more modern. This one, but still a nice, nice old one. Oh, hang on a sec. Look at that. As opposed to FS19, that looks much better. If I zoom in, you can see sort of. Well, look at the soil coming up there. That looks way better. Yeah, that's much better. That does. much better. Well, it's only a little thing, but you know, it just sort of adds to it. Oh, we've just knocked the weight out of the way. Got another tractor over there, which looks like a fairly modern one. Uh, let's see what's on the back of that. It's like a, is that a sprayer? That could be a sprayer. Let's have a, we'll quickly have a little look. Or is that a sower? That's probably a sower. Yeah, I think that's a sower. So let's say all the different fields when you start off um, are in different states. So the one over next door was ready to be harvested. This one obviously ready to be sowed. This one cultivated. Um, and yeah, I think it's only three fields, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, I've got um, got the stones off pivots at the moment. I will turn them on eventually because they do sound quite cool to have on. And realistic beacons, uh, no, I haven't turned that on. Although, what does it actually do, the realistic beacons? Oh, we're missing a little bit here. I'm so used to having a big cultivator. Yeah, I'm good, Nathan. Hopefully, you're all you're all well. Cool. There's the other field over there. How's your farm getting on, Pivers? I reckon there's already a million in the bank or so. You can make money from the stones. Oh. Well, I'll turn it on eventually. Slightly older Massey Ferguson, awesome. 
Oh, and also there's also gears on this as well. So obviously before it was all automatic, but you can do manual gears. So if you want a bit more of a challenge, pop them on. They reflect on the bit. Oh, I see pivots. Might have to give that a go then at some point. Well, not at some point. Um, when I finish this, I'll turn it on. Before I go, can you test to see if workers stay to do their jobs? Well, they should do. It says hire AI, uh, AI worker. So, yeah, it, it, it would. Just like FS19, you can hire them and they can get the job done. And they stay until it's practically done. I'll see, Pivots. Just a wait there in the middle of the uh, field. God. Yeah, much more detail on uh, on here. Obviously, what you would expect from the from the new one. Cool. Yeah, we'll get this field done, and I think after that, uh, depending how we're doing, um, well, 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 we'll see what we can do after that. If I'm off my Xbox, and I don't know if they continue, if you no, they won't. They do it if you're offline. You have to be on the game for them to do the work. Right back we go. Love hearing the gear stick change. You can see the character as well doing it in the uh, in the cab. Yeah, we had a little look um, just before this pivot at the AI um, worker. We set them to bring the tractor back to the farm. It seemed fairly simple, fairly straightforward. Just good. Tomorrow morning, restart on this map. Why are you restarting it, um, laser jet? Right, let's quickly go and visit the tractor over there. This one's, I think, a slightly newer one. Yeah, that one's definitely a slightly newer one. What's it sound like? Sounds good. Sounds like a beast. Anyway, back to the little one. So we seem to start off three tractors. So, um, yeah, if we were to do multiplayer, we probably could do it fairly soonish. I heard a helicopter then or something, but no, I didn't. I was hearing things. Uh, oh, right, let's jet. Yeah, see ya. Thanks for coming in, mate. Cool. So at the moment it's August. There's a high air balloons up there. Yeah, we'll get this uh, field done. But yeah, I think we probably could start doing multiplayer fairly soonish. Um, as, yeah, we've got three tractors. Uh, we could lease some of the equipment. So yeah, maybe... Yeah, maybe this weekend we could um, do a multiplayer. Uh, maybe, yeah, do the Sunday farm. That'll be alright. So I'll probably do another stream before then on this. Uh, just you know, get the things finalised, and yeah, maybe on Sunday we'll set this up, do a bit of multiplayer, and um, yeah, see how it goes. And it's cross-platform as well, so if you're on Xbox and PC, feel free to join as well. I'd wait it bumping up and down the tractor as we're going along. Let's quickly. Sort this out. Let's put that down. Love little flowers you can see as well. There we go, that's that. Let's get some of that. Cool. It's Chanuka on. What's that? Chanuka.
Oh my god. But yeah, on the next stream I'll get the wheel plugged in this for may as well. Leave it um out for now we'll just use the controller. Uh, but yeah, for the next stream I'll get the wheel set up and see how that uh, runs on, on this. And come and try and get up to 30 likes, that would be brilliant. But yeah, tomorrow I'll be streaming Flight Sim, Train Sim World, and maybe, just maybe, we'll do some Euro Truck tomorrow. Although that is very unlikely, doing Euro Truck tomorrow, but maybe. Oh, right, I see. Um, Metro. Cool. Yeah, I love how you can sit sort of bouncing up and down as we go along. That's cool. Obviously, realistic physics. Got the random birds again, which we'll spawn on the field and fly off when you get close to them. Yeah, it's all just going round at the moment. In a minute, I'll, do, I'll start doing rows. I'll do this last little bit here. And then we'll start doing rows. There you go. Let's do rows. Cool. Yeah, we've got a fair bit going on this week. Obviously, on Thursday, we've got Sherman Hill releasing for Trains and World 2. Looking forward to that. Um, obviously, we've had Farm Sim as well. So, a little bit going on this week. And then next week, we've also got another DLC. We've got the Vuzola G6 for Trains and World 2. And probably at some point, Heart of Russia on ETS too. Oh, I see, um, Metro. But thanks all for coming in. Yeah, we'll get this field done. Uh, and then we'll, think we'll call it in there. So we've had, a, we've had a little look at Earl and Grat. And we've done some proper farming uh, in today's one as well. God, and knock the tree down, and off we go again. But you start off with three little fields 38, 41, and field 40, and you get the little yard as well. Hello, Bob. Whenever I create a server on multiplayer, my friends cannot uh, see my game name, and when I invite them, they are not able to join. I'm on PlayStation 5, and they are on the PS4, and we both have crossplay on. Um see my game name that could be because you're on the next gen version Bob possibly uh, I don't know if there is cross gen on this I mean I would think there probably is cross gen but maybe that could possibly be because you, you're you on the next gen version and they're on, they're on the last gen version Although I would think it wouldn't really make a difference, and I still think you probably could join. They could join you. Um, have you got PlayStation Plus? Could be maybe something to do with that. I'm I suppose if you're on multiplayer, you probably do. Hey, Brian, how you doing? Channel mask was here. Now, it could be an issue, Bob. Possibly. There is cross gen and cross platform. Ah. Right, let's get this little bit cold. It's weird having this small cultivator. I'm so used to having the big cultivators. Go back to the baby equipment. Yeah, thanks everyone for uh, coming in on this Monday evening. Hopefully everyone's had a, a lovely day. Maybe being at work, maybe being at school. Maybe you've been chilling out playing farm sim. 
I know I should have lifted the cultivator there. Down we go. Hey Ryan, long time I see. How you doing, mate? Welcome back. Uh, the SD70 Ace will be good in Train Smart 2. Yeah, looking forward to it, Chicago. Sounded and looked brilliant from the uh, preview stream. So we're about halfway done through the field. But we'll get this done uh, and that will then be it for uh, today's FS22 stream. Doing good, just been busy with work. Uh, got a week off, so getting to grips with FS22. Awesome, Ryan. Let's, let's do loops again. Yeah, thanks everyone for coming in. There's the train over there. Now, I'm sure there are a lot of new players to the game, Pivers, but that's that's good. That's good there's new people coming to the game. So there will be some beginners out there who don't know what to do, um, but that's what you know tutorials are for and just a way of learning. Well, okay, this is Farm Sim 22, right? Uh, we both have PlayStation Plus. Do I need to pay for a server? You shouldn't have to, Bob. No, uh, you shouldn't have to at all. I can join another server, fine, but when I try to create one, my friend can't join. I had something similar on FS19. Um, it could be something to do with the connection, Bob. Uh, if you've got a high, um, a high ping, uh, high latency, I reckon that's what I call it. Um, your friends might have trouble joining. And it also might be because um, obviously this is the first day, so a lot of people will be on the servers, so they might be overloaded, maybe a little bit. I know the basics, but there's no the basics. On PS3, throw away from Platinum. Awesome, right? I think that's on PlayStation or well, PlayStation 4. And they remastered that. What is it, Brian? No, Train Some Water we did earlier. Yeah, we did Tease Valley earlier. TSW will be tomorrow evening. Fair enough, Luke. But yeah, I think um, next stream, uh, I think we will think about starting multiplayer. As, yeah, we've got three tractors, we can lease the equipment, um, but not just yet. Because I'm working on the PS3 one. Oh, I see. Ah, the man of questions is back. <laughs> Behold Bryant, the mascot. Evening, Oscar. It's been good. How's your day? <laughs> Very clueless. That's nice farming, Pivers. We need a bigger cultivator. It's tiny.
Is he on you, Jen? Because most player settings, there's a thing saying turn cross platform on. I think Bob was um, trying to play with his PS friends. Oh god, we are making a bit of an interesting shape here. Let's uh, do a bit of that. There we go. He just likes to cut down trees and get lots of cows. I don't do much else. Fair enough, Ryan. Yeah, exactly, Rob. So there might be a lot of people on the servers at the moment overloading it. Do try a different server. I'm not sure how it does work multiplayer on this. I don't know if there is the international server, the Germany server. But I think when we tried it yesterday, it was just, I think, just one big one. So yeah, it might be um, just overloading at the moment. I'm sure they have probably prepared for so I'm sure they sort it out. Do you know when Taurus bus is coming to console? I'm not too sure, it's been very quiet, um, very quiet since that sort of first trailer they sort of snuck in um, to the Aerosoft meeting, the convention thing. So yeah, not not too sure what is going on with Taurus bus, obviously it's still coming. Uh, just don't know when. Evening, Michael. How are you doing? I'll see you, Bob. Almost there. But yeah, once we get this field finished, that will be it. Yeah, tomorrow we'll be on flight sim uh, in the morning. Pretty certain we will be doing it. Um, and then in the evening we'll be back on TSW. So we go again. But yeah, it does look much better when um, cultivating sort of all the soil coming up and just sort of the edges of the bits you haven't done. Much better. Are you going to get a GTA trilogy? Uh, probably not, Michael. No. Do you like cricket? I don't mind cricket, Oscar. I don't watch cricket, um, but I, 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 I don't mind it. Few more rows to do. Even in Richie, wouldn't expect to stream at this time. Yeah, I thought I'd get a little extra one in. Well, we were going to do this one anyway, but this probably would have been the first look stream. Uh, but we snuck one in last night, um, so I thought I'd, I'd get another farm sim one in. Um, yeah, why not? How you doing, Richie? Almost done though. Just going to finish this field up. Busim 22, uh, Busim 21. Uh, we, we still play it, um, just not a lot. But it's a good game. Yeah, this one has a beacon on it, does it? No. Has been delayed till next week. Oh. Oh my god. Almost there. But yeah, how is everyone finding the game so far if you have got it yourself? You played this once and couldn't figure it out, fair enough, um, Richie. It is a game you do have to get fairly used to and there's quite a bit to learn on it as well. Bit of a learning curve. I'm sort of going around in loops here at the moment. Only a little field. I'll say we go around again, it'll be another couple, and then that's that. Down there. Yeah, not 
too much to um, do now. I know the first one was a little bit of a mess as you had that fun bug with the bendy buses losing their wheels and multiplayer and the whole back missing. But yeah, multiplayer on bus in 21 is fairly similar to bus in 18. It's, it is better, but it still lags quite a bit. I'll have to try it on PC though, because I feel like on PC it might be smoother multiplayer. Cool. A little bit around there. There's a little road to do here. Lovely. And we'll go back down for the other bit. I forgot about that. It was a fun game to play buses going invisible. That was a fun one. It sure was. That is near enough to feel cultivated now. I'll go back up for the little bits I missed there. But yeah, hopefully everyone has enjoyed the stream. So do feel free to subscribe. So we don't do farm sim often. Uh, it's usually about once a week, uh, sometimes twice. Um, so we don't do it often, but it's a game where we can get you guys involved as well. That's good to have. Around we go. And we do play other simulator games as well. That sound it does sound like a fun game, um Gordon. It does sound like a fun one. Still live Russian do get. Let's get in this little awkward patch here. And there we go. Let's lift that up. Let's take it over here, park it up. And I think we are done. It's going well, Glenn. Cultivated the field. <laughs> it box of the bus. Sounds good, Ryan. There we go. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be everyone for today's Farm Sim 22 live stream. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. I sure have. That was quite fun. Um, doing a bit of actual farming today. Because yesterday we were just mostly checking it out and seeing what was new. I'm not too sure Russian Dog. Uh, really not too sure. It might even be tomorrow, but I doubt it. Um, if it was on Wednesday, uh, it would be evening time. Yeah, sort of 6, 7 p.m. Probably more. But no, I'll tell you about 5 p.m. But we'll have to wait and see. I'll still keep an eye on the Discord. Um, but that is going to be it for me, everyone. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed that. Obviously, thanks to everyone who has subscribed uh, in today's stream. I'm not really too sure why it says three hours ago. Uh, those who have subscribed, that's a bit weird. Um, uh, but yeah, thanks all for coming in. Obviously, we'll find a link in the description to the Discord server, to the PayPal, and to the merch store. We do have the farming merch there. Uh, British Ace Farm, which is pretty cool. Um, you can cut a tree down for a trophy. You probably can on this, yes. Uh, but apart from that, thanks all for coming in, and I hopefully all see you uh, in the next one, which will be tomorrow around half nine-ish, possibly half nine-ish on Flight Simulator, which is requested by Gamer Boy. But thanks all for coming in, and I hopefully will see you in the next one. See you all. Take care. Bye, guys.